What I want to show you, this is a really, really easy project. This is Tulips Glam It Up and their iron-on fashion design transfers. They're, they're glitter. It, well, no, not they're not glitter. They're, they're rhinestones. rhinestones. Right. I gotta get my glitter and my glam. They're I, shiny. <laughs> <laughs> and this is a really quick project that I want to show you how to iron on the little paw print. I love that. It is so easy to use these Tulip Glam It Up iron-on designs. And I love this little paw print. Isn't this cute? When you open up your package, what you get in this particular package is the large paw print and then, oh, I've got a lot of shine today, there we go. You have the three little paw prints. So you can decide to use all of these on one wearable or use one at a time. When you pull this out of the package, the first thing that I like to do is actually just press to make sure that all those rhinestones are adhered to the plastic. Also, keep in mind that on your wearables that you do want to pre-wash your fabric and be sure that you don't use any fabric softener in the wash or the dry cycles because sometimes that can interfere with any sort of adhering of glue. So pre-wash your fabric dry your fabric and then you're going to want to preheat your iron. It's a dry iron and you want to set it to a wool setting. The next step is to get into this design here and I found it's easy just to kind of cut into where that little air pocket is and peel back the backing plastic And I do this very carefully to make sure all of those rhinestones stay in place where I want them. And then you just leave these right on that plastic and just place your design where you want on the fabric. Take a pressing cloth, which is just a piece of fabric today, and you are going to want to press and hold the iron over your design for about 45 to 60 seconds. So I'm going to move, continue to move my iron, my well-loved and used iron from Heidi Studio. I'm going to move it to make sure that I have the whole design covered. It's a little bit bigger. There we go. I think I have that lined up. So hold this in place for 45 to 60 seconds and all you need to do is just press and hold it over your design and this iron again is a dry iron to set to a wool setting. Now that my 45 to 60 seconds is up, I'm going to take my pressing cloth off and this plastic is hot to the touch, so you're going to need to let this set until it cools. Now that this has cooled, you just peel it back. Adorable! Look at that! So my design has adhered onto the fabric, but the last step is to turn it inside out and then iron it from the back side of that fabric. And you only need to do this for about 15 to 20 seconds. And voila! You now have glammed up your wearable with an adorable paw print. When it comes time to wash this wearable, this is a t-shirt, you would turn it inside out and wash it on a gentle cycle and you want to be sure and let it dry flat or line dry it.